Hi guys, um, I'm going to show you how to report an error with Killing Floor. There are some options for sending automatically options and things, but here is a how to post on forums and what your, your thread should uh, keep and have inside it. So, here's a bunch of things. First of all, I will show you where you can find the forums. The forums, uh, <laughs> Tripwire Interactive, is is the page of where the I keep discussing Killing Floor. First of all, I want to find Killing Floor forum. As you can see, it's not on the top. And then I will find something called technical support and then go killing floor support underneath. I will go ahead and click that. Then I'm gonna register account. I already got an account so I will just log in for the moment and log in. Now you will click new thread. When you Click new thread, you will make a new thing here, making everyone can read your up and everything. So I will go ahead and click this. And when you come in, you should have a title to your problem. For now, I will call my problem with Killing for my problem. Okay. Now I will show you my problem, in this case I know what the problem is, but I will just start off killing floor. And it says critical error, build UT, blah blah blah. And right now I will go ahead and click this button, this is the on-screen port, there's a button called PS or print screen. I will go ahead and print in this and I will come back how to post an image on to the forum later. But right now I will just copy the text, click copy text and go required. And I will write. Uh, I get this error message, and then copy paste that. Then I will make a description. Description. My description will now be a picture, and it will be uh, some. Some words saying, I can't, my killing floor is not starting up. Okay, now I will show you how to get the picture. You want to go start and search for something called pain. If you you can't search for paint if you have XP or something, it shouldn't be too hard to find in accessories or something like that. I'll go ahead and... Okay, my picture didn't work. Something happened here. I'll go ahead and screen just this screen just to make you see how it looks like. Okay, now I will go file. Save as, I will save it at pictures, my user pictures, then I will call it my problem. Save. I can't upload the picture I'm having at the moment, so I have to make it, give it a, a, a internet a page or something. We can discuss that later, but 
I want to use imag imagecheck.us. I will put this in the description below as well. So, you want any problem? I will just log in for the moment. You do not need to log in, but I like to log in so I can save my pictures and find them later. Then I will click browse, browse through pictures and find my problem. Open it and then upload now. Then I want this, this called direct link. Right click it. Copy, close it down, go to my tripwire, then I want to write EMG, and then copy in the link, then write again with a slash the time, EMG, and there it is. And now I will also add a uh, system, my system. My system is uh, what hardware on your computer is. Hardware is your computer, the stuff you can touch. Software is what's inside the computer that you can't go touch. So, my system, to find my system, the easiest thing you do is click start down here, then you want to type run, and click the top thing here, and then write, as it already says, dxbag.exe, and click OK, and here you go. As you see, it, there's a bunch of traveling all over the page. You most likely won't understand a lot of this stuff, but maybe you do. Okay. One of the things you want to do is, and is mostly the most important thing, is processor. So I will go in, go ahead, and write processor. And it says a really long there, but I will just call it info R at the moment. And then I will click in memory. Call it MBRAM. And then someone also wants direct export from you running. Sometimes helps with direct exversion. At the moment, I'm running X10. Dire, dire, X10. I got bad typing. Okay, the next ty thing I want to find is here in my display. I want to go after the device and after the name. So I would just go ahead and type in NVIDIA G. Force A400 MGS. So now we have a complete, complete error message that shows everything. You even have a description, you have your system, and you have the error message. When this is finished, it should. Mine looks like this. And then you have everything that helps everyone else to find what your problem is. But, now I will g go to a bit more advanced thing. It's, it's your log file in your C. No, in your killing floor. So I will go ahead and write killing floor log file. This is found on your computer, so you will go ahead and click start, then go computer, and 
local key hard disk program file, then go scroll down, way down till you find something is named Steam. Then you want to find something called Steam Maps inside Steam. Then you want to click Common. Then Killing Floor. Then you want to go scroll down till you find System. Then you see a bunch of files. People have problems finding the right file, but you, I can say a little thing to do to just find the thing. You want a killing floor, which is more of a little stuff there. It's all also called a ini file. No, God, it's wrong. The without the mark on it. So it's a. You can go to properties and check here that it's text document and log. Text document log. Dot log. So I will go inside. I click here, and here you can see my log file. You can see I has a critical error, but right now I do not know what it is. So I will go ahead and just copy everything inside here and then go back to the forum and then go inside here and copy it and paste it and then you have a complete file and just to make it a little bit funny write help me god damn it <laughs> it always works no it doesn't guys so now you can just go ahead and submit the thread and hope um, we'll see you guys later and hope you this video was help and everything that mongolist shit that i'm supposed to say but i'm not supposed to say it so goodbye <laughs>